Hi everyone, my name is Susan and I want to talk to you today about super early pregnancy symptoms. So before I became pregnant, me and my husband were trying to conceive. Every month I was hoping that I was pregnant, but it was too early to do a pregnancy test. And I would look up on YouTube different early pregnancy symptoms that people had. A lot of the women were saying that they knew they were pregnant, they just had a feeling and they had all of these symptoms before they even missed their period. They had all of these symptoms that were telling them that they were pregnant. A lot of symptoms that they talked about were things like things that were very similar to symptoms that you would get if you were going to get your period. So maybe like breast tenderness or cramping or moodiness. So for me, after watching those videos, um, there were so many months where I thought this must be the month that I'm, I'm pregnant because I'm getting all of these symptoms and then a couple days later I would get my period and I would realize okay I just had those symptoms because I got my period. So now I finally am actually pregnant. I'm in my second trimester right now. Um, so I wanted to let you guys know what I actually experienced when I finally did become pregnant. What were those early pregnancy symptoms for me? I am here to tell you guys today um, that everybody has a very different experience and I don't think it's said too much on YouTube in the videos that I had been watching anyways it was never said but this is what my experience is with early pregnancy so the month that I actually did become pregnant I was sure that I was not pregnant and the reason for that is because the month before I was sure I was pregnant I had all of these symptoms like breast tenderness and everything I listed. Um, I had all of those symptoms so I was sure I was and then I wasn't. And then so the month that I actually did become pregnant, the very next month, I had zero symptoms, nothing at all. And so I was positive that I was not pregnant because I was not feeling any of those things. I didn't feel moodiness, I didn't feel breast tenderness, I didn't feel cramps, I didn't feel bloating, I didn't feel anything. And surprisingly enough, that was the month that I became pregnant. Yeah, it just didn't feel like how I thought it would feel according to all of the other videos that I had been watching. So I just wanted to say, to let you guys know today, just to, to add some extra information onto YouTube, kind of get this word out as well as the other early symptoms videos. Um, that every single pregnancy is completely different. And for me and for a lot of you, if, if you're in early pregnancy before that four week mark, there's a possibility that you might have zero symptoms. You might not think you're pregnant at all. And that is totally okay. You don't have to feel like this innate knowing that you're pregnant and you don't have to feel all these symptoms either. I know that it can be really exciting to try to look for those symptoms, but that's not always going to happen. And the same thing can be said for when you actually become pregnant and throughout your entire pregnancy. I always look at other people's videos to kind of get an idea of what I may be experiencing throughout my pregnancy. Um, but the truth is every pregnancy is so different. It's amazing how different every pregnancy is. There is such a huge wide variety of symptoms that come and go for, for everybody. Um, it's so hard to say how you are actually going to feel when it actually does happen for you. So I know a lot of you may be watching this video hoping to get some insight into what you can look for if you are, you know, just reaching that sort of four week mark where, where you might be getting your period or you might be getting a positive pregnancy test. If you are trying to conceive right now, I wish you the best of luck. I know that these last two weeks before getting your period can seem like they take forever, but it really is just two weeks. Um, and I know that trying to conceive can be extremely hard as well. So please be easy on yourself. Take care of yourself first. And know that there are so many women just like you experiencing the same things that you are experiencing. And there are so many women and other people that are here to support you and cheer you on and just wish you the best. So please, if you do need that sort of support, please reach out for it. There are tons of people out there who understand what you are going through and they are totally ready to support you. So thank you very much for watching this video. I appreciate you coming to my channel. For more pregnancy updates on how my pregnancy is going and for just 
pregnancy videos in general because I love to answer lots of pregnancy questions, please subscribe to, on this little circle right here. And to watch my latest videos, please click on this video box right here. Thank you so much for watching. Talk to you later. Bye. So take a